Hey, what's up fellow YouTubers, fellow toilets and toy collectors, this is Starstream 1988 and today I bring you a review on Hasbro's Transformers Prime Beast Hunters and this is your Series 3 number 8 Commander Class, the almighty Optimus Prime. Yes, he is so very, very cool looking. I love the green. I've, Like I said in my unboxing video um, or my toy review, not to my toy review, I'm sorry, my um, uh, to Toys' Toy Hall. Um, I've never seen a green Optimus Prime. I think it looks really cool. Seen a lot of blue, seen some gold, seen some black. Uh, I've seen some kind of like even brow. Uh, and those were obviously the Beast Wars ones. But green, I don't think I've ever seen a green one. Um, other than the uh, the Bathing Ape one, that G1 um, Classics Remold um, for the clothing line of Bathing Ape or whatever. That one's green, obviously. But this is, this is cool, though. I like this a lot. Back of the packages, as I always show. Um... Side of the package there's, there's absolutely nothing but plastic and some green wholesomeness. Um, there's this technical data, and this is the Beast Blade Optimus Prime. And the front of the package, and look at him. He looks awesome. I sure hope they make a uh, deluxe size, not deluxe, I'm sorry, Voyager size version of this. That would be cool. I would definitely grab that in a heartbeat, because I think it just looks really cool. So can you only imagine, can you only imagine this huge toy here, this, in green. Can you imagine that in green? That would be so cool. Uh, but yeah, that would be so very, very, very cool. So yeah, let's um, crack them open and let's check them out. Okay, and we are back. And there he is. He is very cool. Um, I love the colors. I can't say it enough. Love, love the colors. He is so, so cool. Obviously, you know, the back is still always open there. Nothing's changed, honestly. I like this Beast Wars. Um, I keep saying Beast Wars. <laughs> I like this Beast Hunters version because they still gave him both of his weapons. Um, and you don't have to display them that way. I just kind of did that so you can see them. And then they added a whole new weapon, which is really nice, which is this really cool looking shield here. Um, a lot of these Beast Hunter toys, they've been taking out the original weapons and adding new ones. And I can understand that that's a way to keep costs down. Um, so we're not getting extras, we're just kind of getting um, different different ones, you know. And so, um, you know, it, it is what it is. But um, I like the fact that they still included these and added the new one. It's very, very nice. I like it. Very, very, very nice. Uh, so let's transform him. And um, I got his um, two brothers out. Um, if you want to see what they look like in um, robot mode, you can definitely check that out. Here they are next to him. And uh, let me kind of transform him as quick as I can without hopefully making too many boo-boos. And uh, go from there. Oh, and the shield does open up for some reason. It does this too. Um, oh, I guess that's kind of like a battering ram type of thing. I guess I think you can put that when, it's, when he's in his truck mode. Uh, bring the head down. Do, 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 do. He's not too hard to transform. It's just a little cumbersome with uh, having to move certain bits. <clears throat> uh, see the head. The head always gets in the way there. There we go. <clears throat> Telling you, I love the green. It looks nice. I like that neon green. I like that neon green. I need to bring these up. As I like to call the animals cage there. Snap that carefully without breaking anything. And then make sure that's nice and straight there. And it came out. I hate when it moves. It's not the best transformation in the world. Um, it's okay. Um, and it definitely works, obviously. But they could have done a little bit better job, I think, with him. He's really... He can be kind of tough to try to keep perfectly straight. And that's basically it. And then he's supposed to kind of clip here a little bit. 
but that's okay and then he's pretty much done <clears throat> he's a little he keeps on clipping but it looks kind of like a dumpster truck slash I don't know cage holder or something of course it doesn't have a bag but I don't know, it's just weird looking weird looking vehicle um, the difference is obviously this can go here somewhere where is it I saw it in the picture um, come on last thing you want to do is obviously break it so take your time I'm just kind of trying to rush it here I could swear that I saw this somewhere <laughs> I apologize well you can still put it on the side here if you so wish I think that's mainly mainly I apologize again uh, it's mainly for when you're going to um, um, have it in his robot mode I guess he can hold it and it looks like a like a, a, a shooting shield star whatever you want to call it so, so you can still put those there I really thought you could put this on top of him somewhere like up here I thought I saw a picture of that somewhere but I guess not but yeah I guess the best you can do is just put him here on the side like that Oh, you can put them on the other side there like this. Take this one, put it here as per usual. And he has some kick butt weapons there. So what do you guys think of all the different Optimuses here? I like the colors. I love, I love, um, I don't know, I, I'm a sucker for variants. I've said it before in other videos. I definitely like, I like me different color toys. Um... Some people, <laughs> they collect all the action figures. I don't want to say the lines, but they'll make fun of Transformer fans, us fans. Um, and then I, I'm always thinking, well, you know, the buck that you just showed me has been done for 20 series. So, <laughs> at least at least with Transformers, yes, they might do three, four, five of the same uh, mold in different colors. But it's not 20 series of 120 figures of the pretty, pretty much the same mold. Um, or let's just say you know 80 percent male and then the other 20 percent is a few females here and there so um <laughs> so anyway that's my little rant on uh action figure collectors out there and i i collect a lot of action figures myself don't get me wrong but uh we know which which brands those are the ones that keep using the same bulk um buck all over i'm um, over and over and over so <laughs> so but this is cool. I like this. I like that a lot. That's going to be very nice to display all these different Optimus Primes here. I like it. So, guys, as always, thank you so much for watching my videos. Um, I do appreciate it very, very much. Please rate, subscribe, share, comment. Um, let me know what you think of this new kick-ass green Optimus Prime. This is honestly my favorite of the three. It really is. I like them the best. Um, but, yeah, so I will see you guys later. Peace. You guys take care. And I will see you a little bit later.